I don't agree. I think this decision on the banning combustion engines from 2035 uh, to be a strategic uh, error. Nobody uh, uh, contests that EVs will play a central role uh, in bringing down emissions, but um, staking everything on one option has nothing to do with strategic thinking, as you said. The basic uh, goal is correct. A, a climate-neutral mobility in Europe in the long term to reach climate policy goals. But this must be technology neutral. And we shouldn't just have one single technology, technological uh, solution being applied by all. We don't do this in other areas. In emissions trading, it's about uh, uh, achieving this CO2 goal. Um, uh, companies can choose their approach and the technology. It's not prescribed. So... Uh, why should it be different with vehicles? This kills off innovation and it's not good for climate protection overall because in deciding for EVs, uh, we lose sight of the fact that uh, not, not everything is positive, uh, starting with uh, um, generation of uh, electricity. We have a new uh, dependence on China, the raw materials and uh, uh, Rare earths come from there. Uh, the combustion engine uh, would have had a future. Perhaps, uh, perhaps it isn't uh, uh, viable at the moment. It might be in the future. And important also for uh, planes, trucks and ships. The Commission will, uh, will deflect uh, innovations and other countries will take, step in. So... I don't think it's smart with a view to all the jobs. Uh, Cologne, uh, they're being told that uh, Ford uh, is uh, cutting jobs. I haven't spoken about the uh, charging infrastructure, uh, streets, uh, roads, and uh, the high uh, uh, purchase prices. I'm not basically against EVs, but I'm basically against the idea that in 2035 I'm uh, we can't have climate neutral solutions. Speaker Cutoff. I'm not the only one who thinks like that. Thank you very much, Mr. Arimon. Uh, exceed your speaking time with half a minute, then other members will suffer. So please don't do that.